Welcome everyone, we're looking at May 2019, paper one, so it's non-calculator, higher paper, and no calculator, but you're allowed a whole bunch of other stuff as well. So if you've got it at home, get all that sort of stuff. Uh, tracing paper, rulers, etc., etc. So let's go straight into question one. And it says here that there are only blue cubes, red cubes, and yellow cubes in a box. The table shows the probability of taking at random a blue cube from the box. So we can see that there. And so immediately what I'm thinking is, right, okay, I've got point 0.2. So this remaining lot, knowing that all the probabilities add up to 1, then the remaining lot must be 0.8. Now I do that before I even enter into the question because I need to make sure I've written something down before I do it because that helps my confidence. Then it says the number of red cubes in the box is the same number as yellow cubes. Oh, well, that's okay then. It's the same number, then it's the same probability, isn't it? So that must mean that that's 0 0.4, 0 0.4. So that's good. Complete the table. Oh, done that. Two marks. Now, 12 blue cubes in the box. Work out the num total number of cubes in the box. Okay, so I've got that there, and it says there are 12 blue. And that's kind of neat. If I know that there are 12 blue, let's write this out. We know that 0.2 of the total equals 12. Therefore, I need to work out the total. How to do that? But if 0.2 of the total is 12, let's try to work out, first of all, what 0.1 would be. 0.1 is going to be half of that, 6. And as 1 tenth is 6, then a whole 1 is going to be 10 times that. So it'll be 60. Boom. Right. Now let's go to question 2. It says, Dion needs 50 grams of sugar to make 15 biscuits. Okay, immediately I'm thinking ratio, and I'm thinking, does things go nicely into that? 10 grams, 1.5 biscuits. It's not quick and easy, so I'm not thinking that. And then I'm also thinking, can I read the question properly? I think I can. She also needs three times as much flour as sugar. Oh, okay, so we've got ratio here. So that's three to one, flour to sugar. And then she needs two times as much butter as sugar. So two to one, butter there. And we've got a bridge here. The sugar is the bridge because it's to one to one. So there's my bridge. Remember what we're doing on about all these bridges. So if I just went to the side here and I had flour, sugar, sugar, butter, then look what I can do. Flour to sugar is three to one and sugar to butter is one to two, which means that I've got flour to butter is three to two. Now, I don't even know what the question is asking, but I'm just going on this one because I feel confident with it. Don't forget, if you're doing the higher paper in my group, you're only expected to get up to the staples. So you can spend a bit of time on all these earlier questions to make sure you've really nailed it. Let's just work out what it says here. Dion's gonna make 60 biscuits. So I can see that 60 biscuits is a multiple of 15. It's non-calculator. So if I'm really panicking, I do 15, 30, 60. I can see it's four times. So there's a four times. Notice I'm, on my sheet here, I've got all this information written down because the marker is going to look and see if they can spot things like the times by four, etc. So how much flour do I need? Well, it says, okay, it says I've got uh, three times as much flour as sugar. That's how much I need. So if I need um, 50 grams of sugar, I need three times that, 150 grams of flour for every 15 biscuits. So think about this, 150 grams for every 15 biscuits, and I need 60 biscuits, so I'm gonna times that by four. And again, non-calculator, times it by four, double, double. Double that is 300, double that is 600. And does that feel right? Yeah, feels right to me. So I need 600 grams of uh, sugar there, or is it 60? No, it's gotta be 600, doesn't it? Okay, let's go for 2B. It says on 2B, uh, Dion has to buy all the butter she needs to make 60 biscuits. She buys the butter in 250 gram packs. How many packs of butter does she buy? Now, if you're me, you're looking at this thinking, God, so many words, so many things to do. What can I get my head around? Okay, well, it's 60 biscuits, 60 biscuits. So I'm safe with that. Now let's just look at the butter. It says I need two times as much butter as sugar. 
So I need, so I'm going to write it all out here, for 15 biscuits, I needed twice as much. So I needed 100 grams of butter. Again, write that all out. That's really key. And she can buy the butter in 250 gram packs. Okay, so how much butter overall do I need? Well, 60 biscuits, again, it's four times. So I need 60 biscuits. I need 400 grams of butter. 400 grams of butter. And it comes in 250 gram packs. So hopefully you can see that's two packets I need. Because 400 grams, 250 times two is 500. So clearly I need two packs.